Penny, hello. Here, Sheldon. What is shaking? <laughs> I'm sorry? It's colloquial, a conversation opener. <laughs> so, do you find the weather satisfying? Are you currently sharing in the triumph of some local sports team? What's wrong with you? You're freaking me out. I'm striking up a casual conversation with you. Sup? So, uh, Please don't do that. All right, but I'm given to understand that when you have something awkward to discuss with someone, it's more palatable to preface it with banal chit-chat. So this wasn't the awkward part? No. Oh, all right. Sup? Oh, good, I used that right. Anyway, you're aware that Leonard has entered into a new romantic relationship, which includes a sexual component? Okay, I'm feeling the awkward now. With her name is Dr. Stephanie Barnett, and she is a highly distinguished surgical resident at Fremont Memorial. Yeah, Leonard told me. Good. What he may have left out is how important this relationship is to me. <laughs> to you? Yes. See, of the handful of women Leonard's been involved with, she's the only one I have ever found tolerable. <laughs> well, what about me? The statement stands for itself. <laughs> Well, aren't you sweet? Anyway, should you have any interaction with her, it would be most helpful that she not see you as a sexual rival. Yeah, I think she's pretty safe. You say that now, but consider the following scenario. You're sitting in your apartment. It's late. You're alone. Your hypothalamus is swimming in a soup of estrogen, progesterone, and suddenly, even Leonard seems like a viable sexual candidate. Or a uh, uh, hookup, as it's referred to by today's urban youth. Really? Yes. Now, should that happen, I would ask you to find some way to suppress your libido. I could think about you. Fine, whatever works. Always nice talking to you, Sheldon. Uh, peace out. Um, was in a